Hello, I am Krishna Raghavendran and in this tutorial of MIT App Inventor, we are going to see how to create a random number generator app using MIT App Inventor. So we are going to use the math blocks to create this app. So first, let me tell you how this app works. First, you need to enter a number in a text box. For example, if I type 10 in text box 1 and in the second text box, if I type 30, then it will find a random number between 10 and 30 and then it will generate it for example 17 now if you are new to my channel i create tutorials on mit app inventors so that you can create fantastic mobile apps like we are going to do in this tutorial so start now by clicking the red subscribe button so that you can create fantastic android mobile app so first we are going to bring in a text box and we are going to put this text box to be at the center of screen one so click on screen one and change align horizontal and align vertical to be center center now you can see that the text box one is at the center of the screen let's change the hint of this text box to be type a number next we are going to duplicate this text box ctrl c and ctrl v now here you can see we have another text box so as i already told you in the first text box they will type a number like 10 and then in the second text box let's say they will type 100 then the app will find a random number between 10 and 100 and then it will show it in a label so next we are going to bring in a button and let's change the text of this to be generate random number now let's make the font of this to be bold and we are going to increase the font size of this to be 80. next let's change the background color of this to be orange now we are going to bring in a label in which we will show the random number which is generated. So let's increase the font size of this to be 30. And here we are going to make this to be bold. Let's erase all the text. Now let's go to the block section. First we are going to create a variable. So let's bring in this block initialize global. And here let's change this to be random number. And here we are going to put 0. Next when button 1 is clicked, so button 1 is this button, generate random number. When it is clicked, we need to generate a random number. So for that, we are going to use the math blocks. So let's bring in this block set, global random number 2. And then in the math blocks here, you can see random integer from 1 to 100. You need to bring in this block. So if we put this block, it will generate a random integer from 1 to 100. And then it will show it will store it in this variable now we are not going to do from 1 to 100 we are going to do from text box 1 dot text to text box 2 dot text so let's duplicate this and here let's change this to be text box 2 dot text so that it generates a random number between both of these text boxes next let's we are going to show it in label 1 so set label 1 dot text to we will get the value from this variable the random number variable now let's go to the designer and you need to make sure that you select the text box one and you need to check this box numbers only because we need to allow the user to enter only numbers if they enter letters then it will give an error so we are going to check this box for both the text boxes now let's test the app and let's see if it is working so here you can see the app i'm going to type a number here i'm going to type 10 and then the second number is going to be 100 now it will generate a random number from 10 and 100 so let's click on generate random number and here you can see that the random number is 86 if i click on again you can see that the random number keeps on changing because it's random any number between 10 and 100 now why do we need to generate random number what is the use of generating random numbers so this can be used in many types of apps and games so i'll give you an example so this is a cat catch the cat game which i have created so let me show you how this works when i click on start you can see that the cat is moving to a random position and then we need to click on this cat to increase the score so it, we need to click on the cat before it goes to another random place so let me try clicking it now you can see that the score is increasing when i click on the cat so for this game we are using random numbers now do you want to create the catch the cat game which i showed you now after i make a tutorial on that you'll be able to see it here 
and then also watch the full cost of a mighty app in winter here.